Hey everybody, uh, sorry that I uh, haven't been uploading lately. I know a lot of trailers came out, um, but for right now, we're going to be reacting to the official trailer now for Marvel's uh, Daredevil on Netflix. Up until now, we've been getting like small snippets and small teasers, um, but this is a full-fledged trailer, so let's see what we get and discuss a little bit. I used to listen to people asking for help. That's what I was trying to do, was help people. But I was fooling myself. Darkness only responds to darkness. I'm Daredevil. Who is he talking to there? Prison has changed me. What is it you're saying? I want to make a deal. He's claiming to have changed, but they don't know him like I do. The last time that we spoke, you threatened me. That is something that I cannot forgive. Yeah, that's right. He knows who he is. For good this time. There's only one way to stop me, but you're not going to do it. Are you sure about that? Just be careful that you don't become the monster. Because I've tried to make this city a better place. I will tell the world who you really are. Someone who's now showing his true colors. Sometimes you have to hurt one person for the greater good. The city needs a new villain. I think I might have found him. Daredevil is our true public enemy. Wow. According to eyewitnesses, the brutal attack has been carried out by none other than... Daredevil. Daredevil. It's an interesting angle they're going with. So like I said, it's October 19th when all the episodes will be available. But, hmm, that's a very interesting take. Uh, so I guess Matt Murdock is kind of compromising his ideals and values that he's uh, developed over the years and, you know, like not wanting to kill, you know, trying to do the right thing by the law, but I feel like in season three, he's going to be in a place where he's very broken, where he's, uh, yeah, he's so beat up after Defenders and season two and, you know, like seeing Frank Castle's perspective and all the things that happened with Elektra, but I'm, I'm, I'm really, really glad that season three is kind of like a return to form for daredevil so it's the main conflict if you will is between daredevil and kingpin wilson fisk uh and i guess the tables have kind of turned now because wilson fisk is now gonna probably i guess be seen in a better light and then daredevil's gonna be presumably framed but like he's gonna be seen as like the villain of the city now and i want to see how they play up that angle and who is actually wearing that daredevil costume right charlie cox uh i think he's a really great actor and so is uh, vincent d'onofrio uh it's nice seeing them on screen together again that's what i really liked in uh daredevil season one and two was did they have interactions in season two i don't remember but yeah the whole story with wilson fisk uh, and he's just such a great antagonist for the netflix series so i'm wondering if he'll ever cross over into the other ones um in any case october 19th excited maybe not uh let me know in the comments and uh thanks for hanging out and i'll see you in the next reaction